Hey guys, welcome to yet another Streamlabs OBS tutorial by Carlin Cho Productions. In today's tutorial, we will take a closer look at the color source. Color source is essentially just a simple background that you can add to your stream for whatever reason you might need. In this tutorial, I will show you two ways of maybe utilizing uh, the color source, but of course you can utilize this uh, however you would like. So once you create the color source, you can just go ahead and choose the color that you would like. Uh, let's go with uh, blue in our case. And then you can go ahead and change the width and change the height. So in my case, I'm going to make it 1920 times 1080. Press done. And as you can see, now we have this simple blue background. So let me go ahead and show you the first example of how you can use the color source. So let's say you want to create your break screen. And let's say you don't have any Photoshop skills or you just new to streaming and you just want to create something quick to begin with. You can go ahead and create a color source as we just did. And then you can go ahead and add a text on top of it. Then go ahead and add your own text. I'll be right back. Make it a slight bigger. Go ahead and right click on it. Go to transform and press center on screen. So as you can see, it took us literally 10 seconds and we've created a pretty minimalistic uh, be right back screen. Another great example of utilizing the color source is when you just need a bar, for example, at the bottom of your stream or at the top of your stream or maybe on the side of your stream. So let's go ahead and get rid of this text that we've just created. Let's highlight the color source by clicking on it and let's hold the Alt key on your keyboard and right click on this square right here and start dragging it down. This will basically allow us to crop the height of the color source that we've just created. So let's choose the height that we would like to have. Let's go with this, for example, click away. And as you can see, we've just created a simple bar at the bottom of our stream. And then you can put whatever information you would like to have at the bottom of your stream. For example, let's say you want to have the name of the latest follower in there. You can just go ahead and use the stream label widget. Uh, name it latest follower. Go ahead and add source. Search for most recent follower. And as you can see, it displays the name of the follower. And if you click here, you can add whatever else you would like to have in there. So let's go with latest follower and done. And then let's click on it, drag it and place it right here. And as you can see, we've just created a nice clean minimalistic bar once again <laughs> displaying the information about our latest follower which i think is another great way of using the color source and that's it for today's tutorial guys thank you so much for watching if you have any questions feel free to comment down below i will do my best to answer as soon as possible and i will see you soon with another tutorial bye bye